Oh, Freddy. Yeah, Frank. You better make it a half order. I got a big dinner tonight. She'll say. Sloth? Always. Oh, uh, you got it. Oh, what's the latest? Oh, you know, Frank, same old shit. Almost got killed last weekend. Here? No. State fair down in Virginia. Me and my brother hauling the smoker down there. And this fucking minivan had a fridge strapped on top. A fridge strapped on top of a minivan, Frank. <laughs> Stupid. Well, that fridge slipped loose. Boom! Right in front of us. I had to swerve to the left, barely missing. But now. That smoke is fishtailing and almost hit a hatchback in the next lane, swerved to the right, barely missed it, too. <laughs> Jesus. Man, it was real. But you know, that's why God gave us reflexes, so we can move the fuck out of the way when a fridge come out of nowhere. How them ribs? You know how they are. You know I like to hear them. Perfection, Freddie. <laughs> Perfection. <laughs> you go there. Thank you, Freddie. Mm -hmm. Well, this is a surprise. Text. Where are you? On the other side of the tracks, trying to find the meaning of life. Find anything for me? Do oh, you mean anything newsworthy? Uh, I actually didn't call to badger you. Yes, you did. But that's part of your charm. No. I wanted to tell you that I've been promoted to White House correspondent. I'll have to travel press corps, be at briefings, but around all that. You need me. Won't change anything. Oh, on the contrary, this changes everything. No, I can be flexible. I'm not interested in someone who's flexible. I'm interested in someone who's available. So you think I should turn it down? That's entirely up to you. Well, I mean, it's not official yet. I could... Oh, look, I gotta go. But call me, you know, if you find yourself available again. You see, Freddie believes that if a fridge falls off a minivan, you better swerve out of its way. I believe it's the fridge's job to swerve out of mine.